Good morning. Good morning, and welcome to Deep Carbon 2019. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Bob Hazen, I'm the director of the DCO, and I'm so excited to welcome you all to Washington, D.C. for this celebration. It's a celebration of the past, it's a survey of the present, it's a roadmap for the future, and this meeting is featuring 300 scientists from five continents. I'm, I'm really excited to be here. On a, on a personal level, it gives me such a gratitude and pride to have been part of this organization for actually more than 11 years now. And I'm, I'm thrilled at the science that we've done. We're going to hear some overviews today. We're going to hear more specifics. We have the poster sessions. I think the science is great. Looking to the future is great. But what gives me the greatest pride and satisfaction is seeing the incredible number of early career scientists in the audience here today. This meeting is about you, it's for you, and we are so grateful that you're here. Thank you. So now it's my great pleasure to begin these proceedings by introducing Dr. Eric Isaacs. He is the 11th president of the Carnegie Institution for Science, which has been the host of the DCO for the past decade. Dr. Isaacs is a condensed matter physicist with a PhD from the Massachusetts Institute of Technology. He began his career as a postdoctoral fellow at Bell Labs, where he went on to serve as director of both the semiconductor physics and the materials research departments. Dr. Isaacs came to Carnegie from the University of Chicago, where he served as the Robert A. Milliken Distinguished Service Professor in Physics and Executive Vice President for Research Innovation and national laboratories. In that role, he provided direct oversight of Argonne National Laboratory and Fermi Lab for the U.S. Department of Energy's Office of Science. He also led the university's founding partner relation with the Giant Magellan Telescope. He previously served as provost of the University of Chicago. Dr. Isaac spent five years as director of Argonne, one of the nation's largest science and engineering research centers. As Argonne's director, Dr. Isaacs earned a reputation as a nationally recognized institutional strategist and advocate for scientific research and its importance in driving the United States economy. So please join me in welcoming Dr. Eric Isaacs. Thank you. 